Vigil Swing. And I'm just like, I don't go back. This is what you know, of course. So you know there's a band called Disillusion. We saw them live. They were opening for Pesafone and Obscura. Apparently, Don and Robbers are going to rise out of them. I'm not sure how exactly that goes, but they're doing it. It's the do. It's the do. Double up. Also known as Dawn of Robbers. Well, mainly known as Dawn of Robbers, also known as The Do. Um, we're doing this reaction because The Do got in touch with us and asked us to make this reaction. Thank you guys very much for consider considering our crummy little channel for promotion. Um, they have a new album called Velvet Incandescence and that title is just, it's like, it's like as pretentious and abstract as a tech death title, except it doesn't sound like tech death because it sounds better. Yes. It honestly sounds like leisure in hell. So, and it's purple and it's going to be out in April, I think on prosthetic records. Yes. And, uh, the first album from this band, we both know it and it was good called The Art of Morphology. Strongly recommend you check it out. Do it now. Stop this video. Go listen to the album and then come play the rest of it. Uh, yeah, so we're about to do the do. I mean, no. it is, is the do, but better. Yeah. Okay, so I, it's in many ways similar to the first album, but it, this is the thing with this band. It feels like going out of the house after a week's day, after a week's work of sitting in a room, staring into a laptop and going out there and getting out of the city and touching dirt. Yes, that's how this band feels. And there's, there's this harmony that's so 
healing. That's how it feels. And that discrete sort of orchestral layer or keyboard layer or sample layer or a layer of something that's atmospheric in the background that just adds this light to it because there's this chaos to it. And yeah, I'm going to stop talking because I sound like I'm on drugs, but that's the point. It, it sounds like black metal, except it sounds good. Yes. And you can hear it. We're going to go there again. Prog musicians make black metal that you can hear. I mean, I'm not sure these guys are necessarily prog. They're prog enough. They're prog each. They're prog enough for my inner prog nerd to decide they're prog so that I can feel good about listening to them. It's about me again. Yes. I love the bass tone. That also gives it this sort of wooden, earthly vibe. It's very raw and stuff. Yeah, I think all the bands, almost all the bands who have a high profile bass, let's put it that way, bass sound that comes across really well, usually do this with really clean, crisp production. Yeah. So the fact that they can do this while sounding like dirt, and I don't mean that in a bad way, I mean like actual dirt, yes. um, that, that's really unique and it's really amazing. It's, I don't know how much work goes into their mix, but I'm sure it's a lot of precision to make it sound precisely as not precise as you want it. Yes. Also, she has an epic mask with a big ring above it, and I want to try and throw darts through it. Are we going? Yes!
have more. Well, there's more coming. There's a whole album. Why do you have to wait? <laughs> oh, that was so good. Oh, I absolutely love this band. This is going to be one of the best albums of 2023. No, not a shadow of a doubt about it. It's, it's like it cleared my vision. I don't even know what to say about that second part. That... Other than the new Nail with Viscaris songs. <laughs> exactly! There isn't, there isn't anything I heard lately that had such a beautifully built, crafted, manufactured build up. With so many elements going in it, with so many melodies and still so much heaviness kind of adding up. Yeah. And like that corrosive texture. Okay, so here's what they're like to me. So there's this sense of chaos and demons. <laughs> <laughs> and then th that that like layer of peace underneath, okay, that sort of dampens down the chaos and demons. And when the cleans come in, it's like they reverse, like the chaos takes a backseat and the peace comes forward. That's how it feels to me. And that's what happened when we hit pause and when we had that little build up. And then gradually they turned around again through the second half of the song. I would say that build up is also the most new thing. Like, the rest of the song sounds kind of like their style from the previous album, but that part was new. And yeah, I also definitely got Neil Blake Scar's vibes on the drum patterns with all the tom work on the build-up and stuff yeah. like that. So that was really, really, really cool. The guitar solo, yes. The guitar solo was phenomenal. And the footage during the guitar solo was phenomenal because it had this big, epic, sort of breathy vibe to it, and at the same time they will show you waterfalls with moss on them, and yes. it's like one to touch now. Yeah, man, it reminds me of my mountain trips. Yeah, we used to go hiking a lot in our teen years. Yes. Now we're couch potatoes. Yes. Potatoes! And university slaves. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and we live in laptops, which is why we need to get our nature from laptops. And thanks to the do we can! <laughs> Thank you guys. Um, I want to go out in a forest. I want to go in a forest and listen to this song and to Awaken from the Dark Slumber by Winter Sun and to some black metal. But like without Satan. Oh no, Satan will do. <laughs> but I have to go at night. Mm -hmm. Satan is peaceful to me. He's a wholesome fellow. I think we're done here. Shout out to the drummer. Shout out to the drummer. That drummer is insane. Yes. And shout out to the vocalist, like, bro! Yes! It's, I, I, it's some of the most insane black metal vocals that you can hear yeah. that I've ever heard. And some of the most intense sort of stamina and resilience. Yeah. Like the long notes and like, yes. when do you breathe? She, she's one of those vocalists that have a grudge on air. Yeah. Who don't breathe in, ever. I think we're done. Here. We're done. Here. So if you enjoyed this reaction, we'd greatly appreciate the likes and shares. And if you want to see more, don't forget to subscribe with bells on. Thank you very much for stopping by. We hope you enjoyed your stay and we'd love to see you back at the window very soon. Cross out.